What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Before today's video, I just wanna say we've got a bunch of giveaways going on right now. I'm giving away tins, ETBs, booster bundles, mystery boxes, and a whole lot more. All you have to do to get entered to win one of these prizes is number one, subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on. Number two, hit the like button on this video. And number three, drop a comment down below letting me know what your favorite poll of this video was. Previous giveaway winners have been chosen. Check the description to claim your prize. Now let's rip some packs. What up, pimps? Welcome on in. Hello, hello. Twilight Masquerade is here. Finally, brand new set, brand new TCG set, newest one from Pokemon. It's pretty awesome. Welcome on in, Jay. Welcome on in, Chris. Hello, how are you guys doing? Welcome on in, Uni. Hope everyone is doing well. I know, guys, we're not vertical. We are not in a vertical format, and I have a valid reason behind that. Apparently, that doesn't count towards watch time if I stream in the vertical format. Total bullcrap if you ask me, but it is what it is. So this is what the streams are going to look like from here on out. Good old horizontal format. Hopefully everything looks good. I know it's different. I'm sorry. You can't find us in the shorts feed anymore. At least till we get the watch time. It is what it is. We got to get channel off the ground. But hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone has had a great Memorial Day weekend so far. Hope you guys have been able to enjoy some time. You know, maybe be productive. Get accomplished some things that you would like to. So make sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't, guys. We're trying to hit 600 subs, as well as hit our watch hours needed to get monetized. I was this set and Walmart set. Saw this set. I saw this set and Walmart set. I saw this set in Walmart today, maybe? maybe. I don't know. Uh, yeah, the set was in Walmart. Um, we've got a lot to open today, guys, and I'm excited about it. So to show you what we have, we got our individual blisters, of course. Looks like about seven of them. Okay. We got those. We have a triple blister, which is that there are a couple different versions of the triple blister just with a different promo card. I only got one because uh, aside from the promo, they are the exact same things. Um, I also got a booster box on pre-order. So we are going to be opening that today as well. And then I have not one, but two ETBs. One of which is the Pokemon Center exclusive. So this is a little different. Um, I'll show you these two ETBs side by side. Um, let's see, we'll do this one first. This is the regular ETB. Comes with nine packs, um, has a promo card and everything. The Pokemon Center exclusive has 11 packs and the promo card has the Pokemon Center stamp on it. So there's generally a little bit more, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, more, I'm drawing a blank here. Value? No, not value. I mean, yes, but that's not the word I was looking for. More demand oh. for the uh, Pokemon Center exclusive promos. Um, just, you know, because they're they are a little expensive, a little more expensive. You can only get them from PokemonCenter.com. Uh, we need background music, don't we? Um, but uh, yeah, there's just a little more, a little more value behind it, a little more rarity, a little more want, need for it. So I had a stroke trying to read that. Yeah, I did too. I did too. Um, first off today, guys, uh, let's go ahead. Let's crack open these ETBs. That's the big thing that you guys are mostly going to be wanting to see, probably. By the way, uh, for everyone in stream, we are making a video off of this stream. So if I like just start talking to the camera and I don't even act like I'm streaming, I'm using my video voice. That's why. Just so you guys know. Kenzie's going to edit it down. We're going to do a video on it. Anyway, just so you guys know. What's up, Anakai? Welcome on in. How you doing, my friend? Hope you're doing well. So, all right, guys, first off, let's go ahead. Let's crack open this first ETB. This is the non-Pokemon Center exclusive. This is just the regular ETB that you can get at, you know, Walmart, Amazon, Target, wherever you can find Pokemon cards pretty much is where you're going to find this. Um, pretty much, uh, I think it's pretty standard stuff. Um, you know, you're going to have the, the manual, of course. 
By the way, colors they chose for this set are beautiful. I love the blues and greens. Um, but yeah, so this manual, it's got the set list in it. It's going to just show you all the different cards, all the different artworks, rarities, all of that good stuff. We won't dive too much into that because we do have so much to open today. Um, but yeah, as far as the ETB itself, I think it's going to be pretty standard stuff. We we'll go ahead and take the divider out here. Move that over there. Like you say, the, the normal ETB comes with nine packs, seven, eight, nine. Um, and then we have the promo card, which is an Ogre Pawn, Teal Mask Ogre Pawn. Um, really, really cool card, actually. I actually kind of like that promo. I'm going to keep that sealed up for now. For the time being we'll just set that off to the side uh comes with sleeves like always uh these ones look like they went with black so kind of cool it's got the the ogre pawn on the back of that um code card if y'all would like it what else have we got here uh brick of energy cards you guys have all seen that before that's all standard um dividers same thing there and then we've got our dice, which the dice is pretty sick. Nice, pretty blue color. I really like that. I actually kind of like keeping the dice from some of these ETBs because some of them are pretty cool. And then we have the boys, boysen, boysen and burn counters. Now the uh, poison and burn counters. Uh, so yeah, like I say, pretty standard for an ETB. Um, yeah, really just basic stuff, honestly. Um, we'll go ahead, we'll rip into these packs, and we'll just do one box at a time. We'll do the uh, the other ETB and everything after, and we'll just um, rip into them one at a time, like you say. What's up, Bri? Welcome on in, my friend. Hope you are doing well. Your video voice makes me moist. Thanks, Jay. I appreciate you, man. Kenzie is the best editor. You're right, Chris. I wonder what the cards smell like. Plastic. Pretty much. Okay, first pack of Twilight Masquerade, you guys. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead, if we're gonna open packs, let's just, uh, let's switch camera angles here. They're not camera angles, but uh, yeah. Go on the big screen so you guys can see a little bit better. We'll wait for that stupid camera menu to As go away. I was gonna say, do you wanna refocus while we have to wait anyway? Just in case. Do I need to refocus? Uh, I don't know, but it can never hurt. I don't think I need to. Actually, you know, it's not going to show up in the video, right? Or will it? Yeah, it will. Huh? It will. It will. Never mind. But pack art is cool. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, let's go over that. Let's go over the pack arts while we're waiting for that. So this one, it looks like we have a dragon terraform dragapult, which is really, really cool. Uh, this is the Sinist Sinistra? I think it's what it's called. It's one of the new Pokemon from the DLC. Uh, we got the Ogre Pond with, you know, the mask. That's kind of what this whole thing is built around. Uh, we got the Blood Moon Ursa Luna, which is also really sick. That is a cool Pokemon. Um, and that is, that's all the pack artworks I'm seeing. I think, I think doing four uh, pack artworks per set is pretty standard. Um... So yeah, really, really cool artworks, and I really like the Dragapult and the Blood Moon Ursaluna. Ursaluna, personally, those are probably my two favorite out of them. Yeah, that Ur but, Ursaluna's pretty cool. Yeah, I like so, it. Let's go ahead, guys. Let's just start ripping into these. This is the first pack we have ever opened of Twilight Masquerade, of the first ETB that we got here. Let's go ahead. Let's just start ripping. Um, there are. There's some pretty cool cards in this set. The number one chase card as of right now is the Greninja. There is a terrestrialized Greninja card in SAR that is number one. And uh, I think it goes, I think right out the gate right now, it's like 110, 120 bucks. So pretty standard for a new release. Uh, okay, we got a Skarmory here. We got Applin, Snorunt, Diplin, Community Center, Furigarath, all right, we got the Apple in reverse. We got the Nine Tails in reverse, and for the rare, is a Hollow Infernape. Okay, it's gonna be kind of cool seeing what uh, what they give us for like the different rares and and things like that. I don't, I know there's several different um, illustration rares and stuff in the set. I don't know exactly what all there is though, so it's gonna be really interesting to 
to see some of that. Give me just a second here, guys. Oh, I need to do a thing real quick. Yeah, there we go. That's better. Okay, cool. All right, pack number two. Let's go ahead and see what we got here. Code card. Cool art, though, on the monkey. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Infernape is a very cool mon. We got a Farfetch'd. Torkoal. Kadabra. We got a Halucha. Perrin. Diplin. We got the Cramorant. Reverse Polchageist. Reverse Skarmory, too. A Monkey Dory Hollow. Okay, starting out 0 for 2. 0 for 2 on the first ETB. The regular ETB. Alright. Next up, Dragapult. Come on, Dragapult. Bring us some good luck here. Come on, come on. Code card. All right, kicking it off with the water energy of Varun, Volbeat, Luxio, Goldine. We got a Lucky Helmet, a Mightyena, Iron Bundle Future Card. All right, we got a Reverse Spinnerack, Reverse Chimeco Two, Hollow Chandelure. Oh, for three, nothing but goose eggs so far. It's okay. That's how it goes sometimes, guys. That's how it goes. It's okay. We got plenty of packs to open today. Plenty. Iron Bundle card is sick. I love the art. Oh, yeah, the artists, like, that's one thing that you just... is so cool about, really, just Pokemon TCG in general. Even sets that come out that you aren't really that big of a fan of, every set just has banger artworks. Like, the artists just continue to crush it. That's awesome. All right, we got a Farfetch'd. Torkoal. Kadabra again. Swana. We got a belly ball. Oh, look at him. Look at his big old belly. Big old belly. Snorlax, speaking of big old bellies. All right, we got a reverse kill a Watchel. That's a cool art. I like that. Reverse Crawdot, too. A hollow Team Lu. Also, really cool art. But no pulls yet. I have been hearing that this set does not have the best pull rates in the world. I obviously have not been able to confirm or deny that for myself, because this is, you know, my first ever opening of the set. But I have heard the pull rates are not the best. Saving the good stuff for last. Let's hope so, man. I'm really hoping we can get some good SARs today. It'd be really cool to pull that Greninja, which is the number one card in this set um there's also a carmine uh trainer sar which is really cool there's there's some good ones there's a really cool blood moon ursa luna card um i don't have like a specific chase card you know just uh like to pull some good value you know see some cool arts all right we got a love ball reverse polyrath reverse oh no way is that is that the Carmine? That's not. Okay, that's not the SAR. I was like, no shot. Uh, okay, first pull of the day. First pull of the day. Not too bad. According to Poke Data, right around ten dollars right now. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. We will take that first. Hole is there, of the opening. Is there texture on it? Uh, kind of. It almost looks like she has an outline that looks textured. Uh, not really. Oh. Let's go ahead and we'll put that in a top loader. Not bad. First pull of the day. Those of you guys watching the video after the stream has uploaded, uh, post edit, we'll have Kenzie put the the value pulled, just to just so you guys can see. I know a lot of people like to see, you know, how much cards are worth. You like seeing the value of the stuff, so 
We'll do that for the edited video. Those of you guys watching the video, I am live streaming this right now. So if you're in the live stream and then you see this pop up again and you're like, wait, this is familiar. That's why. That's why. But solid first pull of the day. Very solid. I will take a $10 card to kick things off. And we have a lot more to go. We got an electric energy. We got a Tangros. Venipede. Chansey. We got a Draclope. Kieran. Sunflora. Boomerang energy. Don't know what that is. We got the reverse Dreepy. Oh! We have our first illustration rare, ladies and gentlemen, and it is the Heliolisk. All right. Not bad. Back to back bangers. Heliolisk illustration rare. We will absolutely take that. All day, every day, twice on a Thursday afternoon. All right, let's see what this guy's worth here. Do you want me to timestamp every poll? Okay. No, I'm going to go through the whole thing anyway. That's what I figured, but thought I'd ask. Okay, Heliolisk, what are you worth, my friend? $2. Okay. Still cool. Yeah. No, for sure. I love SARs, dude. I just love the, the caricature artworks. Just very, very nice. Very aesthetically pleasing, you know? We will absolutely take all the illustration rares we can get. All right, three packs remain in our first ETB of the day, you guys. Let me say, we also have the uh, Pokemon Center ETB, which has 11 packs in it. Um, and then we've got a booster box, and we've got a triple blister, and a bunch of singles as well. So, good variety today. You know, different products, and just plenty of cards to open. We have no shortage of packs today. It's gonna be, gonna be a good one. Gonna be fun. We got a Glaceon, Sand Slash, Iron Bundle. We got a Belly Bolt Reverse. We got an Abra Reverse too. The Zapdos Hollow. Zapdos getting some more love even after 151. All right. Love to see it. All right, come on. Blood Moon or Saluna? Blood Moon or Saluna? That'd be really cool to pull the Blood Moon or Saluna illustration rare. As far as like design and artwork and everything, that's probably probably one of my favorite cards I've seen in this set. Granted, I haven't seen all of them, but from what I have seen, I think that's definitely one of the cooler cards, in my opinion. We got a Palafin, a Chiyu, Phantom Reverse, Snorrent Reverse. Oh, to the Sinitra EX. All right. Not bad. Our third pull of the box. Th getting three pulls out of an ETB is not too bad. I feel like that's fairly standard. Every once in a while, you'll get lucky and get something real nice, but... So it's slow, but now we're on a heater. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We out here. Okay, final pack of the first ETB. Let's just rip on in. Hope everyone is doing well. Hope you had a great Memorial Day weekend. Anybody doing anything fun? Anybody in chat have any cool adventure stories from the weekend? He's a happy guy. He's just a happy little fella. All right, we got the fire energy. Gotta spank it for luck. We got a snow run. Chimeco. Chimchar. Whirlipede. We got a Lucian. Darmanitan. Carmine. Bug catching set. Reverse. Nose pass. Reverse. Into a hollow Hisuian Arcanine. Okay. All right. So three pulls out of the first ETB. Not terrible. Not terrible. Not amazing. Not amazing, but not terrible. We will take it. It's all good. 
It is all good. I'm gonna go ahead and I'll, I'll just timestamp in between products, Kenzie. Okay. If that works. Yep. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Remember guys, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Really helps out a bunch. Does not cost anything. Only takes a second of your time. And I just feel like I have no room over here. Let's see, we're just gonna wait for that camera menu to go away so we can continue. Okay guys, next up we have the Pokemon Center exclusive ETB. You see the Pokemon Center stamp right there up front. Um, pretty much the exact same as the ETB, only this contains two additional packs. The other one had nine, this one has 11. And then the uh, promo card, I don't know if you can see that there. I can show you on the actual card though. It has the Pokemon Center stamp on it as well. Um, everything else I think is pretty standard for ETB. Should have pretty much the same stuff in it. Um, like I say, just get the you get the promo stamp there and then two additional packs, which is kind of nice. The designs on these boxes are beautiful. I really, really like that the color scheme that they chose for this set. I just think that's just awesome. The nice reflective green, the blues, just kind of the dark, kind of, I don't know. Just has, a, just has a nice feel to it, you know? Just really, really aesthetically pleasing. Out of here, yeah. They say dice, same as before. We got dividers. Here is the Ogre Pawn promo with the Pokemon Center stamp right there. If we can get the camera to focus, um, exact same card, same artwork, and everything just has the stamp. I'm gonna leave that sealed for now. I may end up sending that off to get graded later on, I'm not sure on that yet. Um, everything else, like I say, is oh, this it comes with both promos in the Pokemon Center exclusive. My mistake, I did not realize that. You actually get one with the stamp and one without, so that's very cool as well. Let's take our packs out of here, and then everything else is the same. You guys already saw it in the other ETB, so we'll just uh, put that away. Yeah, I didn't realize it came with both, uh, both promos. It's kind of nice. I might, I might grade the one that's got the stamp on it. I don't know. I'll look at it and see if I think it's going to be worth it or not. It might. It very well might. All right, we got 11 packs here. Let's just go ahead. Let's get them scrambled up. I already showed you guys the artworks. Same artworks and everything. Just the four. The Ogre Pond, the Dragapult, the Sinistra, and the Blood Moon Ursaluna. Yeah, they really, they really knocked it out of the park with like the the ETB design and color scheme and everything. I think that was a very, very well done on their part as far as that goes. All right, ladies and gentlemen, pack number one out of the Pokemon Center ETB. Let's see if our luck changes up at all. We got three pulls from the first one. We had an illustration rare. We had a, what would you consider that? A full art trainer, I guess. And then just a regular, regular EX. So we'll see if this is better or worse or about the same. I don't know. I don't know exactly what the pull rates are like, but we'll find out. We got a Flebebe, Litwick, Poochiena. We got a Diplin. Wait, is that like miscut? It is. Look at that. We got a... We got a miscut card. That's the first time I've ever... Wow. Um, I'm actually gonna... I'm actually gonna sleeve that. I don't know if that's going to be worth it or, or anything, but like it's got the, like up at the very top there, you can see the text and then the, uh, like the lineup dot from the next card up on the sheet. I don't think I've ever pulled one like that. 
Don't know if it's worth anything or not, but we're gonna sleeve it. We're gonna find out. That's kind of cool. That's the first time I've I've had that happen. Hmm. Not too bad. Someone's aim was seriously off. You are not wrong, my friend. All right, let's continue on. We got the Chi Yu, the Lucky Helmet, Mighty in a Reverse, Halucha Reverse to a Hollow Alakazam. Alakazam getting some love. We love to see it. Love to see it. I, I love Alakazam. I'm a big Gen 1 guy. Alakazam is one of my favorite Gen 1 Pokemon as well. Alright. Next pack. I think that was the first time... Like, I've had cards that have been pretty off-center. But I think that is the first one I've had that is actually, like, completely miscut like that. So, kind of cool. Kind of cool. Imagine pulling like an alt art or something that was cut like that. That'd be worth some some change. That'd be pretty cool. We got a Darumaka. A Corvish. Festival Grounds. Glimora. Holy Roth. We got the Brute Bonnet Ancient Reverse. We got the Feebas Reverse. Oh, to Lana's Aid. Looks like another full art trainer. All right, not too bad, not too bad. Lana's aid, what have we got for value on this out of curiosity? $3, almost $4. All right, not bad, not bad. Go ahead and sleeve that up. Yeah, we're getting some pulls now, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting some pulls. These are starting to starting to get the old juices flowing, you know. All right, next pack. Let's get it. From Paldea and Fates, you got a shiny Garganacle. Nice, nice. It's been a while since I've opened any Paldea and Fates. Here's the code card for you. One to the front. Ooh, fire energy. Spank it. We got a Wattrel. Volby. Goldeen. We got a Spooky Boy. A Diplin. Cramorant. Kieran. Poltergeist. Reverse. Vulpix. Reverse. To a Hollow Teal Mask Ogre Pond. Okay. That's okay. We no cry. No cry. No cry. All right, we're just gonna keep on ripping, guys. Just keep on ripping. We've got, I think around 65 to 70 packs to go through today, so almost two booster boxes worth. So we got some, we got a pretty good number of packs here. Hopefully we can get into some of these SARs. The Greninja would be absolutely awesome. That would be ideal. I would love to pull that card. We got a Rev of Room. Florgis. Reverse. Sushi Fit. Sushi Fish. Kadabra. Reverse. To a Hollow Chandelier. Chandelier. I know, I'm probably like one of the slowest pack rippers in the history of Pokemon TCG YouTube, but it's okay. I like to be careful. You never know when you're going to have an absolute banger pull, and I just don't want to mess it up, you know? We got a Poltergeist of a room, Slurpuff. I almost made a, almost made a really bad comment there. Reverse Tangela. Reverse Snow Run. Oh! To the Teal Mask Ogre Pawn EX. I thought we had pulled that already, but that was a Sinistra EX. Okay, so new pull. New pull. First time pulling this one. Not too bad. We will take it. We will absolutely take it. So far, this ETB pull rates have been a little better than the other one. We haven't gotten an illustration rare yet out of it, but... We do still have quite a few packs left, and we got two pulls already. So, never know. I mean, 
For all we know, this could literally be the Greninja right here. This pack right here could be the Greninja. Dreepy. Feebas. Girafferig. Froki. Okay. It's a good sign. We got a Synflora. Boomerang Energy. Rifort. Reverse Dreepy. Reverse Timber. To a Hollow Enamorous. Okay, I did not manifest the Greninja, but that's okay. Snorrent was very happy he was in an igloo. You know, Snorrent, Snorrent really doesn't get a lot of love. That whole that whole evolution line doesn't get a lot of love, and I, I don't know. I don't think they're that bad. Maybe a little underrated, you know? It just... I don't know. Everyone loves to hate on, on Glalie, and don't get me wrong, it's not the best Pokemon in the world, but, you know... Far from the worst, I think. One to the front. Basic energy. Helioptile. Grookey boy. Finizen. Caretaker. Hostel. Brute bonnet. Another. Wow, that one's cut wrong too. Look at that. Oh, well, I just spoiled the rest of the pack for you. Sorry, guys. But another miscut. Man, two miscuts in the same opening after never really having one before. Was the other one from this box too? Um, or I was it the other? Yeah, it was from this box. Look at that, they're cut like the exact same way. Maybe they were on the next row? Yeah, they must have been like next to each other or something. Yeah, they must have... They, they probably came from the same sheet. That's wild. That's kind of cool. Hmm. All right. All right, all right, all right. That could be good or bad if we if we have that happen on, like, a rare pull. <laughs> Thank you guys for eight likes on the stream, by the way. I appreciate you. All right. Next pack, including this one, we have four left of this ETB. Uh, we do have a spec cards as well. They have returned for this set. Those pink trainer cards. So we could get some of those. Um, I think there's I think there's golds in this one. Not entirely sure on that. I'd have to go look. But we got a slugma. Palafin. Chi Yu. Lucky Helmet. Speaking of A-Spec, our first A-Spec of the day, the Hyper Aroma to the Reverse Goldine to a Hollow Heatran. That's cool. <coughs> Hollow Heatran. I like that artwork. That is awesome. Let's go, guys. We did get our first A-Spec of the day. So shiny and pretty. What are the A-Specs worth in this set? There are gold cards, by the way. I just confirmed that. Uh, there's one that's $12 right now, but it's not this one. It's Hyper Aroma. Oh. $2. $2, Kinsey. Prices are going to fluctuate. Oh, yeah. Prices always fluctuate a ton after a set comes out. So. Yeah. Take everything with a grain of salt, guys. Honestly, by the time this video goes up, the prices might have already changed for these. So the ones you're seeing might not even be accurate anymore. I don't know. You just never know what the prices are going to do. But what it boils down to is we're having a good time hanging out, opening some cards together. All right. We got a Psychic Energy. Limit, Poltergeist, Ducklet, Lampant, Bug Catching Set, we got an Agron, Clefable, Reverse Phantom, Reverse Alakazam, oh to the Luxray EX, let's go, we take it, Jeremy, holla, thank you for subscribing, welcome to the channel my dude, I appreciate you. That Luxray looked pissed. He's very mad. 
He's an angy boy. Angie, Angie Luxray. All right, next up, guys. Two packs left in this ETB, and then, and then I think we do the triple blister next. <coughs> Is what I'm thinking. Code card. All right, we got the dark energy, Phantom, Slugma, Swirlix. Tad Bulb, Sushi Fish, Frig Ref. We got a Rifort. We got a Chansey Reverse. Sandy Gas Reverse. To that Hollow Monkey again. Okay. Hollow Infernape. Final pack of our second ETB. Final pack of the Pokemon Center exclusive ETB. Come on. <laughs> Can we get a little last pack magic out of that box? We did already get like four or five pulls out of this one so you know the box has has done its job it's served its purpose but we'll see we'll always take a little extra if we can you got a chancy tangla glimora area dose excuse me <laughs> just got tired accompanying flute reverse leafy on reverse polywag to the Okie Dokie Hollow. Okie Dokie. All right. Okay, guys. That is the two ETBs. Next up, we have the Triple Blister. Um, again, guys, there's more than one Triple Blister, just with different promo cards. I only got the one. Um, this one has the Rev of Room promo, which is pretty cool. Rev of Room's kind of an interesting interesting Pokemon from the Scarlet and Violet era. Definitely definitely uh, not one that you see everywhere in the TCG game. I don't know if I've seen any like um, illustration rares for him or anything like that yet. There might be. Don't quote me on that. I just don't. I can't think of any off the top of my head. Um, but I'll give you guys the code card from the Triple Blister as well. And then, of course, the Rev of Room. Let's go ahead and let's put that promo in a sleeve. Nice little holographic all the way around the border. Not too bad. Not too bad. And then for pack artworks, looks like we got one Dragapult, one Sinistra, and one uh, Ogre Pond. Teal Mask. Let's just dive on in. Dive right on in. Now, if this is anything like Temporal Forces, could have some crazy luck. We pulled the uh, Raging Bolt SAR out of a triple blister while we were live. And that card is now the number one. I looked today, that card is now the number one card in that set. So crazy pulling that out of a blister like that. Very nice. Hopefully we can have similar luck today. We got a Swirlix, Diplin, Jamming Tower, Glaceon, Reverse Eevee, Reverse Slurpuff, to the Hollow Hisuian Arcanine. Okay. Set those aside. Next up, Dragapult Pack Art. Come on. Come on, come on. Let's get some hype in the chat. Let's get some good luck flow in here. Come on, guys. Psychic Energy. Varum. Watchroll. Volbeat. Goldine. Melotic. Ariados. Kieran. He's such a little twerp. Emolga Reverse. Slugma Reverse. Two. A frost last hollow. Okay. Genuinely don't think I've seen a single bad Eevee artwork. Eevee's just a cool mon. Kinsey loves Eevee. I do. Like a whole lot. Yeah. Uh Eevee does have an illustration rare in this set, speaking of. That'd be cool to pull that. It'd be really cool to pull that for Kinsey's sake. Final pack out of the triple blister, guys. Let's see some gold. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's hope so, Jeremy. Let's keep 
let's just keep those those good vibes flowing I want to see that good luck in the chat psychic energy apong hollywag helioptile corfish lana's aid leafion rev of room reverse caretaker reverse chimchar Oh, to the hollow tinglu. We got nothing but goose eggs out of that triple blister. Not a single hit. That's fine. Yo, TJ with the 20. Thank you, my man. He says, have you some crunchy boy? Hope you're doing good, bro. TJ, thank you. Thank you, thank you, my dude. Let's get some hype in the chat for TJ. The man, the myth, the legend himself. Man is a stud. Thank you, TJ. Thank you for the support, brother. I appreciate you. Now we can go buy more cards. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are these packs hard to open? Uh, no, so far I haven't had any issue with them. <coughs> so far it has not been bad. Um, guys, next up we are going to do the individual sleeve packs here. I grabbed seven of them just to supplement the opening a little bit. Let's just go ahead and let's, I'll, I'll get them all opened up, get the packs out of there first, and then we'll just start ripping into them. Um, like I say, just pick these up just to, you know, add a little variety as far as product to the opening and then just to supplement a little bit, you know, pad it up with some more packs and then we will save the booster box for last because that's obviously like the big uh, the big box you know that's the best way generally to open Pokemon cards in bulk is by using booster boxes if it's a set that you can get booster boxes in of course not all sets have booster boxes but, okay so seven individual packs. Come on, mix them up a little bit here. And we'll just start ripping. Start from the top. We'll have to remember these are individual packs. So if we can get anything, anything cool out of them, That'd be awesome. We got the Electric Energy, Spinarak, Sandshrew, Darumaka, Apom, Heracross, Love Ball, Glimora. We got a Reverse Boomerang Energy, Reverse Floet. Oh! To the Hearth Flame Mask Ogre Pawn EX. Full Art not a bad way to kick off the individual packs let's go what have we got here value wise oh 250 we got 250 chat 250 but that's okay it's a sick card it's a sick card. Not too shabby. We'll take it. All day, every day, twice on a Thursday afternoon. Uh, hey, brother. Hey, everyone. Taking care of some stuff in the background, but I'd be lurking. Just want to say hello. Got those pulse out. Y'all appreciate you, TJ. Thank you for being here. Thank you again for the 20. I appreciate you, dog. You are the homie. You still remember the moment you got into Pokemon? Uh, yeah, actually. I was probably around five, six years old, and my sister got a Game Boy Color with yellow version. And she decided to share it with me, let me play it, and it was a slippery slope from there on out. Here we are. Here we are. <laughs> I have two YouTube channels. Mostly centered around Pokemon. I mean, the other one we do, we play other games as well, not just Pokemon. But uh, yeah, it's kind of crazy how you can get into something like that. It's just a hobby as a little kid. And then, you know, fast forward 20, 25 years, and here we are. Pretty awesome to think about. Dreepy, Bebas, Snorlax, Heracross, 
Talifin. Heliolisk Reverse. Darumaka Reverse. Oh, Blood Moon, Ursa Luna EX. We are two for two on the sleeved packs. Let's get it. Such a sick mon. Such a sick mon. He does have an illustration rare in this set, you guys. If we could pull that, that would be a good day. That would make for a pretty hype opening. We got it though. We're two for two on the sleeve packs. Let's see if we can keep it up. I'm sorry, did you say he has two illustration rares? Or just one? Just one. Oh. Uh, he also has a full art. Oh. And a gold, I think. I think he has a gold version of the full art. So. Ursaluna's pretty cool. Yeah, Ursaluna's a cool mom. But that's Blood Moon Ursaluna. Blood Moon. <laughs> what are you doing to your mom? Chewing on my fingers. Crazy puppy. All right, electric energy. Portugeist. Yeah, guys, subscribe to feed the puppies. Varum. Watchel. Volbit. Leafion. Sawana. Glimora. Reverse handheld fan. We got a little something something. Oh, the Enamorous. Oh, snap. Okay. We got ourselves an Enamorous full art. Let's get it. We are three for three, guys. Have we ever started three for three out of regular sleeve packs before? Not that I can think of. I don't think we have. I do not think we have. That one is also too fitty. Again, guys, by the time the video goes up, these prices very well might have changed. I'll have Kenzie put the prices up in the edit. Um, but yeah. Sick, sick cards. Certain three for three on the individual packs. I like it's facing that. Or I know it's kind of a. It's kind of, that, that mon has grown on me. I'm not gonna lie. When uh, Legends Arceus dropped, and I saw that Pokemon, I wasn't a fan. I'm just gonna be real with you. I wasn't a fan. It's grown on me. It's a good Pokemon. You know, nice strong fairy type. It's definitely got its place in the world, you know? Like everything else. All right, y'all. Let's keep the hype rolling. We had an Eevee. Giraffe Rig. Froakie Boy. Phantom. Bellebort. Accompanying Flute. Boomerang Energy. Lanazade Reverse. Crawdot Reverse. Oh, and we have our first non-banger out of the sleeved packs. That's okay. Starting out three for three is awesome. We will take that all day, every long. Um, and guys, we'll do we'll do a recap at the end of the stream, uh, showing all the pulls that we got, like we usually do. You guys know how we do around here. We show you the pulls, and then we show you the pulls some more. We got a water energy. Paliwag, Helioptile, Orfish, Grookey, Ariados, Accompanying Flute, Slurp, This, Whirlipede, Reverse, Aeron Reverse 2, Oh, Blissey EX, hopefully this Blissey does not become the new Wigglytuff, if you know, you know, and if you don't know, Go check out our past 151 streams. Just you'll 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 see what I'm talking about. Same here. I've grown up playing Pokemon games, and collecting Yu-Gi-Oh cards. My mother bought me Game Boy Color. It came with Tetris, Pokemon Red version on my seventh birthday. That's awesome, dude. That is very cool. So nostalgic, man. You know, like it's just it was just a good era. You know what I mean? Just the Game Boy Color and had the Gen 1 games, then when Gen 2 came out, it was just the most hype thing in the world, because, I don't know about you guys, but, like, at the time, being a kid, I didn't know they were going to make more Pokemon games. I thought the Pokemon that we had was what we had, and that was it. And then Gold and Silver came out, and, oh, man, it opened up a whole new world, you know? I never played a Pokemon game until I was 21 years old. I know, I'm, I'm 
pretty disappointed. I, I think I need to have a talk with your parents about that. <laughs> Yo, okay. Nikki Poo, how do you do? We got a psychic energy. Poochiana. Le Burber. We got a timber. A wrong. Glaily. Glaily. Ogre's mask. Kind of a cool trainer card. Showing the different masks. That's not bad. It's kind of cool. Probo pass. Reverse Volbeat. Reverse Torkoal. To the Hollow Alakazam. Just got home from work. Hey, let's go. Very nice, man. I'm sure you're glad to be off. So you can enjoy the rest of your evening. Okay, this is the last of the sleeve packs, guys. And then after this, we will break into this booster box. So we're almost to the halfway point. But we got the booster box after this. And that's... That's when things really start getting juicy. So, stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. Fire energy. Spank it. Giraffe rig. Vulpix. We got a Froki. Eevee. Handheld fan. Diplin. Lana's aid. Community center reverse. Monkey Dory Reverse to the Monkey Dory Hollow. Okay. So that is going to conclude the sleeved packs for the time being. Maybe we'll get more to open up in the future. But that's going to do it for now. But. Oh, we ain't done. Hope you two have been ho having a solid holiday weekend. Yeah, a lot of work. Uh, been a very productive weekend. I was going to say, we've gotten a lot done that we needed to. A lot done. Yeah. But Last but certainly not least, guys, we have the booster box. The big kahuna. Um, 36 packs. Pretty standard. Um, yeah, this is it. I think... I could be wrong on this, don't quote me, but I feel like I have heard that uh, booster boxes, you're guaranteed to have at least an SAR, at least one, I think. Huh. I'm not entirely sure on that, but I feel like I've heard that. Don't know if that's the case. If so, great. Maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe we can pull the Greninja. That would be ideal. Let's go ahead and get this... Uh, get this booster box display set up here oh yeah oh yeah with the blood moon ursaluna i know we can't really see it too well but okay i think we'll just start from the left side uh let's alternate should we alternate rows yes instead of going all one yes no okay we'll do it we're gonna start on the left side with the blood moon ursaluna pack art let's get it is get it. There's just something about opening a booster box that just, it's like, mm, it just feels so good. It just feels like so many packs, you know? Just a nice, crisp, clean, brand new booster box that's just yours to open up. It's great. Great feeling. Sushi Fish. Farigaraf. Ryfort. Leafy on reverse. We got an air on reverse. To the hollow Alakazam. Alright. Pack number one of the booster box is a dud. Let's see if the first pack on the right side brings us anything better. Opening a full booster box as an adult really does something for your inner eight-year-old self. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> I wasn't. You didn't see me opening booster boxes at eight years old. I couldn't afford that crap. But I can now. <laughs> Water energy. Spinnerat. Sand Shrew. Darumaka. We got Napalm. We got a Palafin. Handheld fan. We got a Diplin. Lucian. Reverse. Fion. Reverse to the Teal Mask Ogre Pond. Holographic. Okay. So the front two 
No dice. It's okay. We no cry. We have many more packs to go. We no cry. We have many more. This pack feels thick for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it has an extra hollow. I would not bank on that being the case. <laughs> Grass energy. Floet. Sunkern. Abra. Skarmory. We got a Diplin. Rillaboom. Lana's Aid. Reverse Festival Grounds. Reverse Slurp this. Dragapult EX. Not bad. First pull of the booster box. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. That's cool. Even the uh, the Dreepy's eyes are hollow. That's really cool. Nice little touch. It's the little things, you know? It's the little things. Alright, first pull of the booster box. Come on, guys. We gotta man- we, let's manifest this Greninja. I really want to pull that Greninja. That'd be absolutely awesome. Come on, come on. Code card. All right, we got the fighting energy. Dreepy. Spooky boy. Bebass. Verpix. Belly boat. Hustle. Holy Wrath. Reverse Sand Shrew. Oh! The Pulcha Guys illustration rare. Not bad. Let's go. First illustration rare of the booster box. Come on. Alright, let's see what that bad Larry's worth. Come on, come on. Come on, Poltergeist, where you at? Where you at, Poltergeist? Two dollars. What Greninja card? Ah, uh, the number one chase card in the set, Nick, is a Greninja um, special illustration rare. He's like all terrestrialized, all crystally, everything. Pulcha has honestly had me angry when I saw it originally. It's not my favorite Pokemon if I'm keeping it real with you. The art in the series is amazing. You are correct on that. They say the artists have just been... Dude, they just don't stop. They just, I mean, banger after banger after banger. They just crush the artworks continually. You know? It's crazy. I don't know how they keep up with it. We got a Dark Energy. Volby. Goldeen. Sandy Gas, Dreepy, Diplin, Chiyu, Lucky Helmet, Reverse Tangela, Reverse Slugma, to the Hollow Okie Dogie. Arcaladon's better than Pulch, you guys. Oh, 100%. 100%. Isn't Macha's drink comparable to yours? Is it really that different? I honestly do not know. I think it's different. I. You could tell me one way or the other, and I'd believe you because I have no reason to think otherwise. I do not know. I don't know flavor wise, but at least I know making it is completely different from tea. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know anything about it, to be honest with you. It's like a powder. Like I'm just here to open Pokemon cards. That's all I'm good for. Warfish! Grookey Boy! Rillaboom! Lana's Aid! Punk Helder! Whirlipede Reverse! Elephant Reverse! Two! The Luxray EX! That is our first duplicate pull of the day! Second time we've pulled the Luxray, but that is okay. Still a banger. Still a banger. <clears throat> a 
ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. All right. Next up, let's get it. <laughs> Come on. Come on now. Let's get some more of these illustration rares. We got an Applin, Snorunt, Leron, Chimchar, Conkelder, Rev of Room, Ogre's Mask. Oh, we got ourselves another A spec to a reverse Swirlix and Hollow Pheasantipity. Our second A spec of the day. All right, and this is the Legacy Energy, which I think is the number two A spec in the set. So not too bad. I hope this doesn't take the place of an SAR. I don't know exactly how that works with the pull rates and booster boxes. Let's hope that's not the case. I don't honestly know on that. Um, hopefully we can have some good luck with some others as well and pull a real nice special illustration rare. There was, um, it looks like there's a gold version of that A-spec too. A gold version of an A-spec? It looked like it was the same, yeah. Where? Down. Oh, That's it's different. That's energy. That's Never not mind. the same thing. I'm like, uh, no, an A-spec is an A-spec. I, yeah, the picture looks the same to me. An A spec is an A spec, but a manwich is a meal. I love manwich. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had sloppy joes in forever. Interesting. So they literally come from the same plant. Matches require more care and attention during growth and harvest. So not really. So basically the same thing, just a little more pampered, huh? Okay. Good to know. That is interesting. I did not know that. I say you could have made up some total BS story and I would have believed you. Maybe he did. Maybe. Giraffe Rig, Vulpix, Froki Boy, Mighty Anna, Rev of a Room, Flawgis, Sushi Fish, Sand Slash, To the Sinish Chair, The Shernish. Shernishir. It'd be nice to see a rainbow card. I don't know if there are rainbows in this set. I know in other sets there are, like some of the, uh, there's some in like the Sword and Shield era that are. I don't know if I've seen any in the Scarlet and Violet era. Are rainbow rares still? Still around? I do not know. I straight up Googled, so take it with a grain of salt to begin with. Fair enough, man. Fair enough. I would have had to do the same thing. All right, kicking this one off with a Steel Energy. Eevee. Giraffe Rig. Froki. Phantom. Squalipede. Bug Catching Set. Ambipom. Lana's Aid. Reverse. Glimora. Reverse. To the Sinistra Hollow. Has the Pokemon Company ever trolled anyone with a pack that's all magic art? Not that I'm aware of, but that would be hilarious. That would be really funny. Unless it was like the magic art from uh, the Scarlet and Violet base set that had the magic art illustration there. I think it was. I think it was base set. That'd be funny. That'd be hilarious. That'd be a funny prank to play on somebody. Give them a pack that you would like filled with magic art cards and then resealed. All right. Steel Energy. Pinsir. Fion. Girder. Venipede. Sunflora. Enhanced Hammer. Glalai. Reverse Poltergeist. Oh! To the Chansey Illustration Rare. 
Very nice. Very nice. I like that artwork. Chansey carrying the looks like a stack of books or something. Then we got the Psyduck freaking out. We got a Ditto, Snorlax, and then a Blissey back at the counter. Very nice. Oh, there's a Bell Sprout too. Not bad. We'll take that. That's a cool card. I like that. I like that. That is very nice. Let's take a little look at the value here. See what we got. Uh, Eleven dollars. I think that is our is that our most valuable pull so far. It sure is. So far, that is our best pull of the day. All right. Very nice card. I like that. Beautiful. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know if I've been accurate on, you know, switching which side of the booster box I pull packs from. I don't know. I might be way off. I have not been paying as much attention as I probably should. Code card. One to the front. Electric energy. Eevee. Phantom. We got a Slugma. Swirlix. Festival Grounds. Glimora. Polyrath. Love Ball Reverse. Jinx Reverse. Ooh. Oh. Okay, it's just a walking way, Kahlo. I just, I just, I thought I, you know, I saw like there down and it looked like, like a full art or an illustration there, like on a beach or something. Like on the right hand side, looked like it was like sand. I, I, I got more excited than I should have. It's fine. It's okay. We no cry. No cry, no cry. All right, next up. Keep on rolling. Did find walking wake on a beach. True. True. At, at first glance, it reminded me of like the Squirtle illustration there from 151. But I quickly realized, wait a minute, that's not the right set. What the heck? And then I was disappointed. It's all good. So wacky. Rev of a room. Ogre's Mask. Sunflora. Another A spec. The Hyper Aroma. Did we pull this one already? Did we? We did. This is a duplicate. A duplicate duplicate. That did not make any sense. I'm sorry for that. It's okay though. It's still a pull. It's still a pull. Man, I really just I want that SAR. Where are all the SARs? Come on. Better give me the Greninja to make up for it. I think that's what needs to happen. Like, right. Like, like real soon. You know? Gotta find the Greninja. Water energy. Aaron. Santru. Chansey. Tangela. Kilowattro. Root Bonnet, Community Center, Dreepy Reverse, Perigraph Reverse, to the Hollow Ogre Pond. Nothing there. Nada nada. Limonada. Alright. Come on. Blood Moon or Saluna, be kind to us. Blood Moon or Saluna, be kind. Code card. If anyone would like to use them. Alright. Grass energy. 
Tad bulb. Apple. Flibuber. Wait, wait. Hassel. Group on it. Ambi palm. Reverse belly boy. Reverse chimchar. To the Iron Thorns EX. All right, we got ourselves another pole. All right. Kind of a tough set so far, it feels like. I don't know. Am I wrong for saying that? It's just so far, it feels like a tough set. I'd say so. You know, it just... I don't know. It just doesn't feel like we're pulling a whole lot of heat. I have heard the pull rates are really tough in this set. It's what people have been saying. That is the word around the grapevine. Fire energy, spank it. Slugma. Tadbull. Applin. Swirlix. Agron. Cook. Clefable. Reverse Karuki. Reverse Agron. To the heat ran. All right. We need a good heat ran illustration rare. You know? I'd be all for that. Like chilling rain. Yeah. Chilling pain. Yeah. That's okay, though, guys. We've got... We've got so many other... Hard, so many other different sets and products and stuff to open up in other streams like even if this this does turn out to be a little bit of a disappointing set and a disappointing opening we got so much heat coming up for you guys we got evolving skies we got a big we're gonna be opening another booster box of evolving skies soon which is crazy so crazy to me that I'm doing that but we're doing it crazy or not we're doing it and it's not the first time we've done it either. Spank it again. Shut up, Jay. No. I'm not gonna do that. Ugh. Yeah. I'm probably clinically insane for wanting to open another booster box of Evolving Skies, but... It's an addiction, man. What can I say? So if you're watching this, if you're watching this video after it uploads, A, subscribe to Feed the Puppies. B, subscribe because we got a lot of opening uh, of Wilding Skies coming up. So that's always cool to see. Maybe we'll pull the Moon Brion. Who knows? Got to be subscribed, though. We got to find out. Hit the notification bell. Be part of the Nodi gang, you know? Kill a Watchel. Mighty in a reverse. Glaylight reverse. Pheasant Dipper. Well, hot damn. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but Reese is in the camera. He's in the chair behind oh, Ty. Yeah. He's just hanging out. Yeah, we got a puppy sleeping behind me. He's pretty cute. He's tired. He's worn out. Yeah. All right. Next pack. By the way, guys, if you're not subbed to the gaming channel, go drop a sub over there. We have got some real fun stuff coming up. Like, real soon. In fact, I'm going to start the prep for it on stream. Find it tomorrow. Maybe tonight, though. We'll see it. Maybe we'll maybe we'll do it tonight. It's going to be fun, though. It's something I've been personally waiting for for a long time. Blaboober! Timber. Sushi fish. Ferrigraph. Jamming Tower. Illumash. Daromaka. Tail Mask Ogre Pontiac. Another duplicate. Reese worked a whole 12 hour shift, leave him be. Should we reveal why Reese is tired? I we wanted haven't to really save officially it. revealed that. Yeah. Can. Okay. Come here, bud. Let's get your cards out of the way first. Okay. We have a surprise for you guys. We have a surprise. Oh. 
This is the surprise. We got a baby. This is the reason Reese is so worn out. I'm just waiting for the comments, I but know. nobody's. <laughs> so this is Link. His name is Link. He's five weeks old. He's yeah. just a little baby. He's just a baby boy. And he's doing really good with house training and. Hey, don't bite me. He's teething. Bite me. I better give him back to you. <laughs> You guys will be seeing a lot more of him. Don't worry. He's here to stay. Why so tiny? Uh, so yeah, so most dogs, uh, they won't let him away from their moms until they're like eight weeks, you know? Not corgis. Corgis, and I didn't know this until recently, like, a lot of times three to four weeks. Like, we got him at four weeks, right? Three and a half. No, I think it's four. Is it three and a half? Well, so we picked him up on Tuesday. He was born on a Thursday. Okay. So it was in between three and four. So just shy of four weeks when we got him. And he'd already been on solid food for a while. Already been, you know, weaned off his mom. Already had his first vaccinations. Yep. Corgis apparently are very independent in that way. And yeah, so that's why he's still so little. He's just a baby, but he's doing great. Definitely the youngest dog we've ever had. Mm Mm-hmm. By far. It's a whole different experience. Link is a sick name. Dude, I, yeah, I thought so. I thought it was a cute name for him. It was either going to be that or probably Winston. And we just couldn't come up with cute nicknames for Winston. Yeah. So. I didn't like the nickname Winnie. And I'm like, you know what? I like Link. I think Link is just, I don't know. Maybe it's because I like Zelda. I don't know. But. And it suits him. Yeah. I thought it was pretty Now, pretty I mean. Cool. <laughs> Must lick face. Yeah, and he's teething too, so it's like must bite nose. Yeah, he's still and it working. It hurts because his, his teeth are like razor sharp. You know, his puppy just... teeth are still coming in. Yeah. So. So that's Link. You guys are going to be seeing a lot of him on the channel. That is Reese's new baby brother. Although, <laughs> biologically, Reese is actually his uncle, so that's kind of cool. Reese's brother is Link's dad. So, kind of cool. Yeah, he's doing good. Doing good. You gotta love the puppers. So subscribe to Feed the Puppers. Brute Bonnet. Community Center. Iron Bundle. Morpico. Conkelder. Iron Leaves Future Hollow. All right. Nothing there. That's pretty neat. Yeah, right? Yep. But for all intents and purposes, like, Reese is effectively his big brother, you know? He's a little annoyed with him at first and still gets annoyed with him sometimes, but they've be- they've become pretty good friends. Reese has gotten really good about playing with him, and he, uh, he's a little tuckered out because of it. Pretty much all Link likes to do is play and sleep. Fire energy. Spank it. Hochiana. Palo sand. Timber. Spinnerat. Bug catching set. Agron. Clefable. Bug catching set. Reverse. Cramorant. Reverse. Frostlass hollow. It would have been great if you pulled a yamper while showing Link. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> right. Oh. Not gonna lie, guys. The set feels a little rough. It really does. I'm just gonna, just gonna keep it a buck with you. The set feels a little rough. That means the values are gonna be higher, right? Not necessarily. Oh. Um. It's rigged. It feels rigged. There was a dog. He pulled a poochie and a true. Fire energy. Spank it. That's two in a row. We gotta have some good luck here now, right? Come on. Manifest the Greninja. We want Greninja right now. Dang it. What if, though? That would have been cool. 
<laughs> that would have been hype. Better than Wigglytuff, though. I mean... Yeah, but my luck with 151, way better than this. Unmatched. Way better than this so far. Unless your name is Venusaur. And then you can just piss off. <laughs> Seven Charizards, though. Somebody give me a freaking trophy for that one. All right, Electric Energy, Sunkern, Abra, Skarmory, Applin, Robo Pass, Love Ball, Scolipede, Brute Bonnet, Chi Reverse. Again? The same one? We got another one. We got another one. All right. It's a pull, though. Did I just hear a growl? He heard Peanut walking down the hall. Oh. That was him growling? I thought it was Peanut growling. It was him. Jeez, Link. He's learning quick. Chillax, bro. It's all good. He's starting to doze off, and I think it scared him. Gotcha. Come on. Give me an SAR. Give me a Greninja SAR. Come on. Water. Hey, Pam. Hollywood. Helioptile. Horfish. Sand Slash. Lucian. Darmanitan. Reverse Snorlax. Reverse Girder. To the Hollow Infernate. Another one. DJ Collet. For real, dude. For real. This set. I just, I don't want to say it, but the set is not really tickling my jimmies that much. I just, I'm going to be honest with you guys. You know me, I'm a transparent, blunt person. My jimmies are not being tickled right now. They're just not. It's just not doing it for me to this point. Bellybot, accompanying flute, spin a rack reverse, he ran reverse, hollow and for it. Haven't heard that one in a while. <laughs> well, normally it's like rustling majimmies, you know, but I don't know, tickling came out for some reason and it got all weird and personal. I don't know. Come on, guys, let's get some freaking luck here. Like, good luck. Give me a good card. Give me something really good. Come on, give me the Blood Moon or Saluna. Give me the Eevee Illustration Rare. Give me the freaking Greninja. Give me the Carmine. Give me something. Come on. Chimchar. Pinsir. Bellebot. Accompanying Flute. Boomerang Energy. Applin. Veron. Son of a... <laughs> boy oh boy coming down to the after this I think we're at 10 packs left give him something that'll tickle it yeah give me something that'll tickle my jimmies sorry it's not shivering your timbers yeah I need something to shiver my timbers guys come on shiver my timbers right here this pack. This pack right here. Come on. Greninja, let's go. Nope. Nope. He just needs more cards to spank, dude. I need something. I need something. Come on. Let's get it, let's go. Come on, Electric Energy, Dreepy, Beebass, Girafferig, Vulpix, Boomerang Energy, Slurpuff, Perrin, Reverse Ducklet, Reverse Iron Bundle Future, to the Cornerstone Mask Ogre Pawn EX. That's a new poll, that's one we didn't have. 
that's like a that's like a one percent timber shivering. What? I don't know. I don't know, dude. Man, we might have to open some Lost Origin or something after this just to make me feel a little bit better. <laughs> I don't know if that'll... That might have the reverse effect, actually. Yeah, know. that might not do it. But if I pulled the Giratina, then I'd be happy. If we could pull the Tina, that'd be sick. Come on. Come on, tickle my jimmies. Just do it. Just just a little tickle. Just a little tickle. Just a little something something here. Come on. Imorga. Oh! Cramorant illustration rare. Okay. Alright. It's something. It's it's a little bit of a jimmy tickle. It's, it's just a little bit. We'll take that. We will take that. Alright, Cramorant. What are you worth? Two dollars for that. Who? Count them. One, two. Two dollars for the Gluck Gluck 9000 bird. Come on. That card almost looks blurry. Like the way that it's... Yeah, it kind of does. Like the card itself is blurry. Yeah. Interesting. Glad I'm not the only one. I thought my eyes were messed up. I thought I was having an aneurysm. Okay, we're down to eight packs, question mark. Can he math? I can math. <laughs> Weird bird, cool card. Yeah. It's an illustration rare. It's something. It's, it's not what we're after. We really have not pulled what we're looking for at all so far. Literally the most valuable card we've pulled out of this is like 10 bucks. And that's probably going to drop soon. So, really haven't got what we're looking for out of this set. Not even going to lie to you. Definitely, definitely taking a huge loss on this one. Unless that Greninja is in these last few packs somewhere, we're taking a big loss in this opening. But I'm doing it for you guys. I'm doing it because I love you. If it were just for my own entertainment, I probably wouldn't have bought much of this set. Honestly, this set just right from the beginning, I just kind of eh. Doesn't doesn't tickle the jimmies, as I've mentioned once or twice, you know. Heracross. Seeking. To the Blissey again. Again. At least I have more respect for Blissey than Wigglytuff. No kidding. At least Blissey can, you know, do some good in Radical Red, if nothing else, you know. Why is it messed up too? I feel like I got sunscreen. Ew. That ain't fun. Sunscreen in the eyes. Oh, excuse me. Not a good time. Was it the spray or cream? Big difference. Code card. Alright, water energy. Brokey. Eevee. Phantom. Slugma. Milotic. Ariados. Kieran. Tadbulb Reverse. Hollywag reverse. I literally can't. Literally, guys, I can't. I literally can't even. Hopefully, we're at least getting some decent watch time off of this. To uh, progress toward the channel's monetization. Speaking of, don't let me forget, after we finish opening these... I'm gonna, I was going to talk to you guys about that. Because I found out something that made me a very, very unhappy boy. 
Fighting Energy. Heliolisk. Ducklet. Imoraga. Snorlax. Morpico. Carmine. Caretaker Reverse. Floet Reverse. To a Hollow. Chandelure. Yeah, those of you that are in the live stream. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you about it in a little bit. Come on. Final four. All right. Dark energy. Caretaker. Limit. Lampant. Portugeist. Sand slash. Iron bundle. Lucian. Shinx reverse. Skarmory reverse. To the Zapdos. Alright, come on. We're down to our last three packs here, guys. Come on. Is there any chance at all we have an SAR in here? Please. Please, please, please. Reverse Rillaboom. Reverse Torical. Caretaker! What you got for me, old man? What you got, Caretaker? A dollar? A dollar? You come into my house. You make me open 70 packs. And you give me a dollar? The disrespect. So rude. The disrespect, guys. Insane. Absolutely insane. You should be about tree fitty. I was hoping for like, you know, 20 bucks. Not even close. Not even close. Code card. Come on. Grass energy. Swirlix. Tadbulb. Applin. Flibuber. Gluck Gluck 9,000 bird. 3,000? 9,000? 3,000. I think it's 3,000. Sushi fish. Furigraph. Enhance my hammer. Polyrath reverse. Oh! Sinister EX full art. Okay. We're getting a little bit of Jimmy tickling toward the end. Not anything crazy. Nothing to make me go, wow, that was fun. But. We're getting... That's also worth a dollar. It's something. It's something, I guess. I just... I just don't know, man. I just don't... I'd, I'd rather open up 151. Or Revolving Skies. Or Crown Zenith. Or Lost Origin. I think I'd rather open Paradox Rift. Last pack of the stream. Last pack of the video. Come on. Can we... If, if, if there was a time for last pack magic... This would be, this would be an okay time for it, you know? Now's the time. Now's the time. All right. Electric energy. Hisui and Growlithe. Monferno. Nosepass. Nicki Minaj. Heracross. Halifin. Handheld fan. Poochie and a reverse. Lorgish reverse.
That was rough, chat. That was rough. Holy cow. I don't even know what to say. That was... I would go through all the polls, but honestly, there's really nothing... There's nothing good in there. Well, we got a few $10 cards. Doesn't mean they were good. No, but... I, I just... I don't know, man. I don't know, this set kind of just... I don't know. Like, out of all that, that is all our pulls. This is all of our pulls out of all of that, big and small. I mean, couple illustration rares, couple of the cheaper ace specs, couple full arts. From one of each of the products of this set. What? Um, like all of those pulled from 70 packs. Yeah. Yeah. Dang. That was rough. That was a... I think that was over $300 worth of cards. And that's what we pulled. That's rough out here, guys. Honest thoughts, and it's just my opinion. Honestly, not a fan of this set. I I looked through the set list a little bit before starting, and if I'm being completely blunt with you guys, completely, you know, up front, wasn't impressed, even from the get-go. Um, there... There's, I mean, there's a couple cards. There's a couple cool cards that I'm like, oh man, that's, you know, that's not bad. That's kind of cool. But as a whole, as a set, not impressed. Um, and then you add the really poor pull rates on top of that. And it's just, I don't know if we're going to be opening any more of this on the channel. Maybe a little bit if we like get some tins or something in the future, or like if there's like some cool collection boxes or something that we want like the promos from. Maybe we'll open a couple more packs. Nothing big though. I'm not gonna spend the money on another booster box. There's from... not a pack hiding in that box, is there? No, there's not. Okay. But I'm not gonna spend the money on another booster box of it. Probably not gonna spend the money on another ETV of it. It's just kind of. There's a lot better sets out there that I would much rather hunt from, you know. Don't get me wrong, still glad to be here, streaming with you guys, hanging out with you, opening some packs. That's always a good time, regardless. But as far as the set goes, personally not a fan, you know. Definitely, definitely not, not, uh, it, it doesn't do it for me to each their own maybe you know maybe you guys saw some of these cards and were like holy cow that's such a cool card that's one of the coolest cards i've seen and that's fine to each their own everyone is allowed to have their opinion on what they like and that's great just personally it doesn't do it for me so we'll be uh we, we still got 151 we're gonna be opening we're still hunting that venusaur that's the last card in that set we need. We still have Evolving Skies that we're going to be opening. Um, I don't know when that's going to be it. I got some other stuff I need to do before we do that. Uh, got a little bit of Lost Origin. Should we open one of those packs of Lost Origin just, just for shits and grins? They're right behind you. Just for, just because. Sure. There was uh, something that you found out that you wanted to talk to them about too. That you said a little bit ago. Oh, yeah. So... Yeah, we, I kind of mentioned it earlier, but, um, yeah, so normally we do these live streams in vertical format. Um, 
you know, just cause like it looks good with like the shape of the cards. It's just clean. It, you know, pops up in people's shorts feeds. We get a lot of views from doing it. It's great. It's helped us grow the number of subs. Well, when we do that, that doesn't count towards our watch time. Even though live streams are supposed to count towards watch time, if they're in vertical format, they don't if people find them through their shorts feed. I did not know that until like two days ago. And to be honest with you, I wasn't happy. That really, that, that bothers me. I feel like that is a total ripoff for creators. Um, especially since YouTube themselves haven't said anything to the best of my knowledge anyway that has come out and like spelled that out and let creators know about it. So I've been spending thousands of dollars opening these Pokemon cards on stream trying to grow this channel and very little of all of that has even counted towards our watch time to getting monetized. So kind of a kind of a kick to the nuts if I'm being honest that's kind of a like it stings it really does um yeah anyway so at least till we're monetized we're gonna be doing these this format for streams which I'm sure you guys are okay with you know the views are gonna go down drastically I'm sure just cause then we don't have it in people's sh shorts feeds and it's it just, by nature, the views aren't as good, generally. Um, but now, hopefully, <coughs> barring anything else that's stupid that YouTube has hid from us, hopefully now it'll at least count towards the watch time for the channel. Hopefully it'll get us somewhere. That's what we're hoping for. We should definitely start opening the 151 packs. They're pretty dope. Uh, we currently don't have any. I need to get more before our next opening. Yeah, it's a huge slap to the face, dude. It's, I I can't believe that, like, at the very least, YouTube themselves needs to make that abundantly clear to creators. I still have not been able to find anything, even after looking for it, that has said from YouTube that that would be the case. Because they say from watch time, watch time from live stream counts. I knew that it didn't count from shorts. I was aware of that. But a live stream, just because it's in vertical format, that's still not a short. That is still a live stream. If you ask me, that should count. Kind of sucks. Kind of hate it. Nothing I can do about it. So, I needed to get that off my chest. I've been... It, it was a little demoralizing, if I'm being honest. I feel like I've kind of... Inve we've invested a lot into this. And to have that happen has been kind of been a bit of a kick to the nuts so but i appreciate you guys though those of you guys that show up to streams regardless like you guys are awesome just it's always a good time to hang out with you um we've got something else here just as a little extra bonus that we'll do um i was thinking about maybe doing a video on these i don't know i really don't know if we'll do that or not but just because i want to open something that's not this set look what i found today it's like a mini booster bundle. <coughs> mini booster bundle. Uh, booster bundles normally have six packs in them. These have three. It's literally just three packs of Lost Origin. Saw them while we were at Walmart, and I'm like, we can snag a few of those. That'd be kind of cool. Um, don't know anything about them. I don't think it's actually an official Pokemon product. I think it's like... I don't even know. The packaging makes me feel like it's kind of similar to like those mystery boxes you see. But if it's three legitimate unweighed packs of Lost Origin, you know, here we give it a try. Why not? So let's go ahead. Let's open one of them up. Uh, we're going to save the rest of them. I think I got five total. Um, we'll only open one for now. We'll save the rest for later. But we have been doing a little bit of a... We haven't really started chasing it yet, but done a little bit of a search for the Giratina. Out of this set, there's an amazing alt art Giratina card that would just be absolutely fantastic to pull. <coughs> I need a glass of water. You have yeah. my water? Oh, I have it over here. Yeah. <clears throat> it is not officially licensed Pokemon, but <clears throat> we have purchased from these people before. 
as long as the packs are legit. Yeah. You know, like that's the big thing. As long as the packs are legit, like that's literally it. It's just three packs. That's all that's in there. Um, let's take a look at them. It appears to be sealed and untampered with. This one feels a little loose, but that just that happens sometimes. They all appear to be sealed. <clears throat> Hopefully they weren't weighed or anything like that. Let's try them out. We'll see if they're legit. Ah, white code card. Dang it, I forgot about that. I shouldn't have shown that to you guys. I've seen those. I never noticed them until today. I saw that you could get them in Lost Origin or Astral Radiance, and I'm like, I'll pick up some of them. If they're legit packs, that's kind of cool. <clears throat> Isui and Zoroa. Snover. Macha. Pikachu. Silicon Reverse to the Spiritum non-holographic. Okay. So far, seems legit. Seems like a normal, normal pack. You know, hopefully that is the case and they are completely untampered with. Uh, not going to show the, oh yes, I will show the code cards. Just won't show the other side. Just code card for you. Go four to the front. All right. <clears throat> Water energy. Isui and Sligu. Electric. Toolbox, Shep, Wormple, Dynamo, C Dot, Horsey. Oh! Alright, the Cast Form Trainer Gallery. Oh, to a Giratina V. Double banger. Okay. You asked for the Giratina. Man, that, that's not the Giratina I wanted, but I didn't specify, I guess. <laughs> All right, these packs appear to be legitimate. Yeah. Because if that was weighed, that would have been a heavy pack. You know? They seem legit. Maybe we'll get more of them. Maybe we'll use those as one of our main means of chasing our Giratina. Because, like, the price per pack is pretty close to where I've seen everywhere else, I'm pretty sure. I should double check on that. <clears throat> I don't know. I'll look into it more. But if the price per pack is pretty close, we we might get more and more of these things. That's not bad, guys. Code card. Four to the front. Alright. Fighting energy. Lampet. Iskin. Dotler. Binacle. Gumi, Bronzor, Snover, Jinx, Sui and Slagu. Ah, to a Trevenant. That is technically a pull in this set. Nothing crazy, though. We did get a Trainer Gallery and a Giratina V out of the second pack. It's not bad. Do we want to open more of those? Yeah, you're kind of feeling it, huh? I'm trying to decide. I'm trying to think of what else we have to open. If you want to keep going today, I would say those. Since we just did one. What do you think, chat? Do we want more Lost Origin? What are we feeling? Or do we save them? We have other tins, too. We haven't even been live for two hours. Maybe we can go for a little longer. YOLO open everything. We're not opening everything, Jay. Come on. <clears throat> do you want to... Do you have somewhat of a budget? I was going to say, do you want to show them how those wiggly tufts ended up? No. Oh. <laughs> no. All right, you want to hand me another one of those? Yeah. Maybe we'll just do like three of them, too. I don't know. We'll see.
Yeah. As long as these are legit packs, like this is kind of a cool way to buy them. I've never, I'd never seen these before, before today. I'll have to look though. If we do like a serious Giratina chase, where we're like actively looking for that alt art card, then uh, we'll I'll have to look for the cheapest price per pack option I can find. So this may be it. It may not be. We'll see. Uh, code card. There you go. Not looking at him. I want to save a little bit of an element of surprise. Okay, Steel Energy, Misfortune Sisters, Oregon 2, Lake Acuity, Gligar, Gumi, Mawile, Slugma, Clefairy, Spiritomb, Trainer Gallery, awesome, I don't think I've pulled that card before, so I'll take it, alright, let me pull up Lost Origin on Pokédata. That's a sick card, though. That Giratina is almost 500 bucks out the box now. Not the one we pulled. No, not the, the other one, one we pulled. They know that. Can I you? just wanted to clarify. They know that. You can tell by looking at it that it wasn't a valuable card. Yeah, I have that Gengar card. Why am I not seeing the spirit tune? Right there. Oh wow, fifty cents. That's it. Can say you should look at the cast form and the other Garatina while you're in there. I, I I've already seen them. They're not. Oh. Yeah. Never mind then. But they look cool. Yeah. Bonus footage. <laughs> is that a trainer gallery or is it a nightmare gallery? <laughs> okay, I thought it was funny. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> These aren't going in the video, by the way. I know. They're just. That's why so I'm not know. worried about. Yeah, these these are just these are just bonus for the people in the stream. Code card. Come on, dude! If we pull the Giratina, I'm gonna scream. I hope you guys know that. If we pull the Giratina, that instantly becomes by far the most valuable card I've pulled. So, just so you know. Chandelier reverse to Eden Electros. Okay. We're cooler than people who only watch the video. We like all viewers, Jay. Hopefully you guys watch this and the video. We gotta fight YouTube back and we gotta get that watch time. We need to start playing dirty. I don't know how you do that, but you know. Yo, what up, coach? How's it going, man? Sorry you did miss the Twilight Masquerade opening. If I'm being honest with you, I don't feel like you missed out on a whole lot. I personally think that set kind of sucks. So we're opening some Lost Origin now. For funsies. Alright. Water Energy. Hariyama. Nuzleaf. Torkoal. Wormpole. Rhyhorn. Murkrow. Horsey. Mawa. Reverse Beautifly. Ooh! Galarian Berserker V. Full art. Oh, that's the alt art for... I was like, whoa! That's pretty valuable. That's a different card. Where is this guy? Hello? Hello? No way it's clear down here. What? 36 cents? 
There was another Berserker, too, that was worth more. I know, but it wasn't this one. I know. I'm in a... Yeah. Man, I thought that'd be worth more than that. That's the problem with having so many cool artwork. Dang. Well, fine. Want to open another one? Yeah. All right, we'll open some more. Yeah, twisted his arm. Yeah, you guys talked me into it. <laughs> oh, I want this. Come on, I don't want to damage the packs. Come on. Use your opening device. Called a knife, Kinsey. Well, I thought YouTube might not like that. You know what? YouTube's screwing me out of watch time. I don't give a shit what YouTube likes. Yeah, talking to you, YouTube. You hear me? Screwing us out of watch time when we're trying to get monetized, you dirty bastards. Damn it, Susan. Freaking rigged ass YouTube. The stream just ends. <laughs> <laughs> Smoke just starts coming out of the computer. <laughs> like, uh oh. We Sorry, made him angry. We're... Sorry, we're kidding. Damn it, Neil. Susan is retired. Oh, my bad. Says. Way to go, Kinsey. Sorry. All right, steal. Machoke me, daddy. Mirage Gate. Cascoon. Yasui and Zoroa. Bionicle. Gumi. Bronzor. Snover. Nothing. Why does the Buffalon have, like, pink and blue around it? I don't know. Because it feels like it. Okay. Alright, come on. Psychic energy. Panic Mask. Cedra. Right on this. Clefairy. Roselia. Oregon. Inke. Blip Bug. Who? Ooh! Enamorous V. I don't even know what to call that anymore. Is it a trainer gallery? Is it a full art? I don't know. Is it valuable, though? Let's see. I don't think I've ever seen this card before. Three dollars! Sick card, though. Yo, sick card, bro! That is really cool. Imagine somebody using these cards to actually just play the game. People do it. I know, but... Tree dollar. Tree dollar make you holla. Which is like somebody not caring what you could sell the card for and just using it and using a $600 raw card. Okay, so that was in the reverse slot. This was the actual pull from that pack. Yeah. In case anyone was curious. Pretty sick card. Yeah. I think so. I think that's a cool one for the collection. We have two more of these after, right? Correct. Okay. All right. Grass energy. Gastrodon. Haunt that. Holy world. Machap. Pikachu. Phantom. Sudowoodo. Electric. Reverse Cascoon. To a Hollow Kingdra. That is technically a pole. That's cool art on that Kingdra. Uh, Kingdra's a cool mon. Another box. You just want to hand me both of them. Yeah. We might as well just open them all right now. 
but yeah. We got two more of these boxes, guys. Wait, you're not supposed to play with them? I mean, you can. Where is... Here we go. They really packaged those, didn't they? I mean, yeah. Like, tightly. I wish you could get Evolving Skies and packs like that. For the same price. It would not be the same price. No, it would not be, but I would buy all of them. <laughs> like, I would buy out every freaking one I could find if You'd they were. be going to Walmart every day. Yeah, every day after work, I'd be stopping at Walmart, buying them out. Code card? If we pull the Giratina, I'm gonna freak. Alright, Electric Energy. Machoke me, Daddy. Mirage Gate. Fantina. Litleo. Infu. Litwick. Snover. Rhyhorn. Reverse Hoopa. Non hollow. Alright. All right, all right, all right. Let's get it. Next pack. All right. Grass energy. Box of disaster. Electric. Suing Sugu, Oddish, Love Disc, Phalanx, Hollywood, Blagger, Reverse Ride on this, Ariados, Non Hollow. All right, two duds in a row. Is this whole box going to be duds or do we have a pull here? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. Actually, you can just stay here. Yeah, just stay here. Dragon Ball Z is not going to tell you anything about this channel. Looks like this channel is not going to tell you anything about Dragon Ball Z. Alright. Okay, Fighting Energy. Holy World. Licky Licky. Relicant. Tynamo. Litleo. Mianfu. Litwick. Snover. Hey! We got Snorlax Trainer Gallery. Two, a Magnezone V Star. Double banger. I do already have that Snorlax, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that is not my first time pulling that. <laughs> Where are you, Snorlax? $2. Hell yeah! <laughs> Let's sleeve him up, shall we? Don't sleep on this pole. <laughs> Good morning. I see what you did there. You, you was a funny guy, TJ. Link did not like that laugh. <laughs> Good morning. The first time he did it, he, like, looked up at you and glared and then laid back down. He's like, I'm trying to freaking sleep, Dad. Crazy. Magna's own V-Star. All right. Okay. We have one more box of these guys. Three more packs, and then I'll leave you alone and let you carry on with your evenings. Sleepy pupper. He sleeps a lot. 20 hours a day. He doesn't sleep 20 hours a day. Probably. No. Not at one time. I don't think he sleeps 20 a day. He's a, he's awake more than that. He is a sleepy boy, though. He's just a baby. Just a little baby boy. Alright. Our last three-pack of Lost Origin. I like Lost Origin, you know? Good set. Need a game night soon?
We'll talk. We'll talk. Keep your plans flexible. I'll say that. Because I agree, we do need a game night soon. Code card. Ooh, we got ourselves a V-Star marker. Wow. Right on this. Roserade. Komala. Mawa. Shellos. Binacle. Oregon. Ducklet. Hey, we got the Pikachu Trainer Gallery to a Hollow Vial Plume. Not the first time I've pulled this card, but it is cool nonetheless. People like Pikachu, and that is quite off-center, but that's okay. That's a $5 card right there, ladies and gentlemen. It's our most valuable pull of the night of this set. Cool. We got it. We got it. All right. Right on this rose raid. Mm -hmm. Okay. Two more packs. And then I will let you carry on with your evenings. Or to the front. Ooh, we got a fire energy, got a spank it. Carbink. Nuzleaf. Relicanth. Wormple. Clefairy. Lickitung. Horsey. Shepard. Swan Reverse. Non hollow. Aridos. Okay. One pack remains. One pack remains, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's get some hype. Let's go. Dark energy. Obama snow. Lost City, Carbink, Flipbug, Finian, Spinarak, Paras, Inke, Reverse it to a non hollow. Okay, that's going to close that out. I, like I say, though, guys, I do want to open more Lost Origin. I do want to hunt for that Giratina. I do want to, and there's uh, not just the Giratina. Um, there's some other really cool cards in here as well, though. Like the Aerodactyl alt art is sick. That is a really cool card. Um, I already have the Rotom alt art. That's a cool one. There's a Pikachu V Max. There's a Pikachu alt art. There's there's some good ones. There's some good ones. I definitely plan to open more of this. Giratina is the big one, but anywho. Guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I appreciate each and every one of you. You guys are awesome. Those of you that show up, watch these videos, watch these streams, hit the like button, subscribe, all that good stuff. You guys are the reason this channel can exist. I appreciate the heck out of you. Uh, if you enjoyed, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. We are trying to hit 600 subscribers at the time of recording this and trying to get monetized. So do the things, hit the buttons, be a good viewer, and I will see you next time. Bye.